Okay, here we are, recording, doing the thing. Why does my mind always come to a blank conclusion whenever I try to record anything? I don't know. So, today's video is a watercolour drawing thing. There it is. Just came up on screen. Amazing. I have great timing. So, uh, this one is obviously two people in a shopping cart and um, I don't have footage of the inking on this video. I don't know why. I think I recorded it, but I can't remember if... I transferred it over. So if this whole video seems kind of rushed, I guess, and um, a little bit thrown together, it's because it is. As I mentioned um, in last week's video, probably not last week's, but the week before that, because there was um, a late video, that was the last video that I made and things got complicated so I just decided to make a video this week rather than try and rush to get yet another one done within such a small period of time. Uh, so as I mentioned I have been really busy and I still want to do YouTube but I've done this pretty stupidly and I haven't uh, actually made any kinds of backup videos which really really sucks. So. I don't know whether or not there will be a video next week. I plan on there being one, but I'm not 100% yet because on Wednesday, which is in three days, I get my wisdom teeth out and I don't think I'm going to be able to make a video for a couple of days. Uh, I really, I really don't want to record myself just not sounding like a normal person. Um, but the thing that I'm worried about the most is the fact that um, Mayhem Doodle obviously wraps up, uh, I think, yeah, it wraps up at the end of August pretty much, and it is very close to the end of August, and I just wanted to say, if I don't get a video out on time, I am still going to do a video, I'm going to feature everyone's amazing artworks that they have done and joined in with, so if you use the hashtag Mayhem Doodle, you're probably going to wind up in a video. Let that sink in for a minute. You could wind up in a video. I mean, you could very well just make your own video, but I don't know. I thought it would be fun. And I am starting to have second thoughts about Mayhem Doodle and some ideas on what it could become in the future. Because obviously I've um, dropped off it a little bit uh, because like I said, I have gotten busy and the idea of the challenge wasn't to um, well, no, it was. It was to do 31 doodles in August, but not do one every day. So yeah, I think I think it's safe to say that I kind of have failed. And I'm kind of okay with that because sometimes failure is just not worth... I don't know. It's not worth pushing yourself too far. But I'm starting to wonder, and this is kind of an informal thought. Let me know your thoughts on my informal thought in the comments below. Maybe Mayhem Doodle, like hashtag Mayhem Doodle, should be a hashtag that you guys use. Then at the end of my videos, I can feature a couple of people who have hashtagged Mayhem Doodle recently. Um, I just thought, you know, that might help get people's names out there and help spread the word a little bit. I don't have a huge following, but I've got a bigger following than I did a couple years ago. And, you know, I know what it's like. It's hard to start out. I, I remember getting my first hundred followers and just being blown away. Um, so yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think of that, because I think that could be really, really cool if I just feature people at the end of the video and be like, yo, check out these cool artists. So if you use the hashtag Mayhem Doodle, you'd wind up at the end of the video. That'd be kind of cool. I, I think that's kind of cool. But like I said, let me know what you guys think, because I don't want to do anything that uh, you guys don't want to do or are not okay with, I don't know. Um, yeah, so as you can see, I actually inked this with my dip pen, as I have been doing for the hashtag Mayhem Doodles. I'm doing this on a Fabriano um, 
watercolor paper postcard because they were really cheap at uh, the art store that I go to and I just I just wanted to try it out um, and I thought it would be good for mayhem doodle because they're only small and yeah I've just been using my white knights watercolors which reminds me I actually found my Holbein watercolors which is what I used to use. I found them a couple of days ago while I was decluttering my room because I'm becoming a minimalist. I'm going over to the dark side of stark white Instagram aesthetics. And um, I thought, oh, this, that could actually be a really good video if I compare, uh, not Winsor and Newton, White Knights and Holbein watercolors because obviously I've had quite a bit of experience with the both of them. I think I've been using White Knights for a little over a year and I started playing with the Holbeins again and I was just like oh these do actually have some better qualities and some less better qualities <laughs> I don't know so yeah I I just wanted to get a video out for you guys on time I'm sorry if this wasn't the greatest thing in the world but you know what you're not always gonna strike gold just some thoughts a video a chat a ramble let me know what you think of the uh, hashtag mayhem doodle idea and let me know what you think of the white knights vs holbein idea because i would really love to explore that um okay cool video's over i'll let you return back to your life i hope that you enjoyed stay tuned for the next video hopefully next week we'll see goodbye <laughs>